and the romance of the competition is alive and kicking down Hertfordshire way. When Jim O'Brien put them in front on 19 minutes. But the Yorkshire side, who are currently bottom of the championship, have leaked 42 league goals this season, and their defensive vulnerability was exposed by Belgian midfielder Frank Musa, who equalised with a plong. Then, in the best cup tradition, the League One side waited until the last minute to score their winner. Leon Clark's 18th goal of the season, enough to secure the upset, a place in round four, and Bedlam among the travelling faithful. It's a great win for your old club, who've, again, had kind of troubled times, all the hassle over the stadium, not playing yeah. at the Rico of late. So, a lovely distraction, as you said earlier. Sometimes the cup comes at the right time. And my grandson goes and sees them now. Mm. He's other than that. So I'm glad to see that they're going along and see some good football being played with Stephen. Stephen Presley said he's done well. He worked with a lot of kids at Falkirk and brought them in great and he's doing the same thing there. So I'd be delighted for them. If he could just sort this ground thing out, it'd be fantastic because they are a good club of good people.